Good morning, everybody. I don't have much time for breakfast today, so let's see what I can quickly pull out of the freezer. Ever had any of these before? Gluten-free, non-GMO. They're kind of processed, but let's give them a try. All right, like most waffles, these are pretty easy to make. Just pop them in here in the toaster oven, turn it on, and while we're doing that, let's take a look at the ingredients. Get in the light here. Zoom in. Water, gluten-free mix, brown rice, a lot of that brown rice flour, non-GMO. A couple of ingredients here I don't understand, which is not good. You always want ingredients to be whole foods if possible, but at least this is probably a one of the better waffles that you know we can we can have so anyway let's see how they turn out okay also while we're, while we're waiting for these we're gonna get some uh, orange juice let's see what's in this orange juice uh, pretty much mostly orange juice but a few ingredients and I think those those ingredients are actually the calcium and vitamin D that's included in this one also, while we're waiting for these things to cook, I'm going to get my supplements together. Believe it or not, I take all these supplements every morning. Not every morning, actually. I try to take them every morning, but it ends up being maybe three times a week because I don't want to take everything every single day of my life. But as you can see, there's a lot of things. and Obviously, some of these aren't natural. Let me know in the comments what you think about all these, if you guys take any of these types of supplements. And I also have a resveratrol that I usually take, which is the extract from grape juice and I don't have any on hand so I don't have any here today to take. There's all my supplements ready to go and we are still waiting on these waffles. Okay these guys are done. Let's carefully take them out. And of course, before we eat these, I'm going to put on some syrup. We got some 100% pure maple syrup here. Check out the ingredients. That's pretty much it, pure maple syrup. All right, of course, I have a little bit of a sweet tooth. Put lots of syrup on here. And, you know, of course, brush your teeth after you eat all this stuff. There's nothing worse than a coating of sugary syrup on teeth that aren't brushed to get lots of cavities. Mmm. Okay, I've cut them up as I always do ahead of time. Give these things a taste. Mmm, very good. I recommend it for a quick alternative for breakfast. But remember, anything that pretty much most foods that are a shade of brown, I would not consider a health food. So, yeah, you could do worse on a breakfast, but you could also do better. But it's definitely a good option, you know, for for a quick meal if you need one. So uh, comment up below on what you have for breakfast, what your breakfast ideas are for quick breakfast, plant-based, vegan breakfast, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.